Hey guys, in today's video, let's upcycle the waste glass bottle. So as you can see, this bottle has some stickers and I want to remove it. So for that, I am taking some water in a container and I am adding some detergent to it. And I will stir it a bit and I am putting my bottle in it and leaving it aside for around 15-20 minutes. And then I am removing the bottle and scrubbing off the stickers. Next, I have to prime the bottle white. So for that, I am taking some gesso. If you don't have gesso with you, you can use white acrylic or chalk paint as well. So I am taking a sponge and dabbing the gesso gently like this. And once I've covered up the entire bottle, I'm going to leave it aside to dry for a while. Next, I'm making a decor champagne. So for this project, I decided to go with this beautiful feather printed napkin. Next, I'm removing the extra plies, the extra layers of the napkin. This is the first layer. And this is the second one. I'm removing it carefully, making sure I don't tear the napkin. Then I'm taking the deck fudge glue. Here I'm using the Little Buddies Deco Magic Glue. You can use Mod Podge instead of this as well. Next, I'm just deciding how much paper I'll be needing and I'm tearing off the extra napkin. Then I'm applying a layer of liquid glue and carefully pasting the napkin on the bottle. Be very careful and patient and just enjoy the process. So I'm going to cover this entire bottle with the napkin. So it should look something like this. And then I'm just tearing off all the excess napkin. Then I'm applying a layer of glue above the napkin. And I'm going to leave it aside to dry. Next, using some white paint, I'm going to blend the napkin with the bottle. Then I'm making this code which I have handwritten and a piece of paper which I have painted blue and pasting it onto this area. And I'm pasting the code on top of it so that it gives a nice bond. I have handwritten this code and I really like how it turned out. I'll make sure I upload the calligraphy video on my Instagram. If I include the clip in this video, then this video might turn out too long. So if you want to check that out, I'll make sure I leave a link to it in my description box. Next, I'll cut out some butterflies out of foam paper. So I'll just place them and see how it looks like. And once I'm happy with the positioning, I'll just go ahead and I'll paste them using some glue. After that, I'm just adding in some decorative embellishments to fill up the empty spaces. And lastly, I'm taking some thread and wrapping it around the top portion. Lastly, I'm adding some varnish to give it some shine and also protect it from dust. If you don't have varnish, you can use two coats of Mod Podge 
and it will get your work done. And this is how the bottle turned out. And this is it for today's video. If you like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And see you in the next video. Bye.